How's it going? Hey, this is a uh, a Duff Norton Journal Jack. He's uh, babies, uh, probably next to the slaves that built the pyramids. Pretty much have done about as much work. Uh, these are also known as a barn jack, or a railroad jack, or a ship jack. These are raw mechanics, no hydraulics. Basically, there's a screw mechanism inside of there, and it comes out to the side. You get a big steel bar, and put it in here, and you set the uh, which way you're going up or down with this rocker. Start jacking. carrying handle because it weighs a ton. I think that one's about oh, it might be about 15 ton. They only have they don't have a lot of rise to them. They've got about well they've got about as much rise as the thing is tall. So that one's probably got about roughly five inches of rise to it. Nice thing about those is you can use them anywhere where uh, electricity is a no-no. The other nice thing about them is those don't creep down. You can put those in place and lock them and forget about them. Um, since it's kind of a screw mechanism, there's no hydraulics to bleed down. They make some big ones of these too. Some of those things are up to 50 or 60 ton. And they definitely got a lot of oomph to them. You need to jack a building up. That was the way to do it back then. That one was probably built in the 50s. As a matter of fact, they still make these. Uh, they're made out of aluminum nowadays, or uh, I think ductile iron. And they are not cheap. One jack will set you back about $1,000. You'd find these in a rigging place or a building moving place nowadays. But every once in a while you see one floating around. Uh, this one kind of lost its way and found its way over to my house. So I've been kind of cleaning it up. The other great thing about these is they are pretty much indestructible. A little oil and that baby is ready to go back on the road again. There's just about no moving parts on these things and there's nothing to break. Anything that's breakable is pretty much easily repaired. So there you go. There's the Duff Norton Journal Jack. Take her easy.